Alright, how are we doing today, ladies and gentlemen, if there are any ladies watching this bit video, which I don't think. But anyways, how are we doing? I hope you're having a great day. I am so far. Today, I'm making this video to talk about Roblox hacking. So, my friend, was sent, my friend sent me this two images on Discord this one time. He apparently got banned for one day for apparently texting in chat. Um, he got apparently reported by a hacker that was already exploiting in the game that he was playing, which honestly does not make any sense to me, because how in the world can an exploiter, who's supposed to get re reported themselves, report some other person for not doing anything? Like, also, I also have a question whether Roblox actually even reviews the reports, because you can almost get reported in Roblox for almost anything, if that's... I mean, if that's happened to you before, please comment down below. If I need to get fact-checked, please also comment that. But basically, this hacker, he was exploiting. He was using a bunch of game commands and stuff without permission. My boy was playing. He was having a good time. Um, and apparently, he got banned um, for one day because he was talking to another person online. And apparently, his offensive item was but we just had to get to he just said that in chat that's apparently what what and it's calling up as as harassment okay so I, I want you to just look at these two images honestly so it just says banned for one day he got banned for one day there's two images his offensive item was but we are just trying to have a good time the reason is harassment all right there's multiple accounts there's it, there's another offensive item that says, sure, it's dead. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but I think it's in the game or something. And reason, harassment. Okay, I, I don't get this at all, guys. Uh, I don't understand. All right, there's another one right over here. It's like reason, uh, harassment, offensive item, and yeah, I don't understand how having a normal conversation with someone can get you charged with like harassment. I I honestly don't get it. This has happened to you before. I I under I hope that it's been resolved or something. But he did not go up to whatever and get unbanned himself because I don't think he'd want to do that or forums whatever. I don't know what you call it. But basically, imagine you're just having a good time. You're just hanging out with your friends. You're chatting. You're playing a, your favorite Roblox game. All of a sudden, poof! You you're kicked out the game. Soon as you get back to home screen, you're like, ah, oh, guys, I'm gonna hop back on. This happens. You just hit with the ban for one day. I, I mean, it's never personally happened to me. I've done nothing to get banned personally, but my boy over here was not doing anything wrong. He he got banned by a hacker, a hacker. So I don't un okay. So I don't understand how a hacker could ban people and report them. Like, isn't that just asking? like a self report on someone because if you're if if I was a hacker I'm not a hacker guys if I was a hacker I would not take the chance of reporting someone else in the case that I would myself probably get reported but I I don't get how hackers themselves can report I don't know I already clarified this multiple times and right now in these for what four minutes that this video has already been going on um but yeah Roblox Roblox hackers are actually being a big deal i've heard that some of them actually were in some games they were actually like invited to be one of the helpers or staff members of the game instead of actually being punished because apparently they were so good with their hacking that they just had to be accepted by the team no punishment what anyway so i i just really don't understand that and there's also a lot of already game admins and stuff and staff members that have been exploiting in their own games which honestly does not make sense because they're not even the owners but they are still being caught exploiting for some reason so this 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 issue is very big um i mean not very big it's just a game but honestly uh it's just getting very annoying you're just chilling you're, you get bent what all right so you i'm pretty sure you plenty of you guys have experienced this um personally I've only hopped on a hacker server once. Like, I was just uh, let's. I was on uh, what was it? Blocks roots, right? I was on blocks roots. I hopped on grind, 
I hopped on the grind. Immediately, what I saw on the server was a bunch of people with numbers. I was like, oh. That, those are hackers. Oh my god. I saw people flying. I saw people freaking building Minecraft blocks in a robot. What? How? Yeah, that was my reaction. I'm not I'm not even capping right now. Um but guys, serious yeah, serious like I'm not even going to Roblox really needs to fix this stuff. They need to find those hackers and they need to either and like and they also just really need to review the content that's getting reported because how do they know that it's actually just reported content? Like how if Someone just says, oh, yeah, what's up, bro? They get banned for that. Like, they have to actually, rep like, review that content well enough to understand that someone's, they did, didn't do anything. They need to, that's one of the things they got. Next, they just got to find, they got to make some bots or something or just form a team just to find hackers. I don't know if they already have this. If they do, then they need to improve it because exploiters are crazy these days. There's freaking sites already set up for people to hack on robot they need to shut those down if they can i don't know if they can if they those are not in their rights or whatever but they need to just improve their hacker finding whatever majiggy if they have a machine for that i don't know they need to stop these guys because they're honestly just annoying everyone uh because of all of a sudden all right let's just say you're playing some uh pets uh some type of tycoon game, okay? Uh, tycoons, no, no one really plays those anymore. But let's just say you are, like, you're a little kid playing a tycoon game. You hop on the tycoon. The person, the person right next to you, as soon as he walks in, ten minutes later, he's got the biggest fortress ever. All of the weapons, whatever you call it, like, honestly. Yeah, so, I, I that's how it just gets annoying. Um... But yeah, that's basically how hacking is should not be because these people are just like breaking the rules. Like just I don't understand how it's even fun in the game just to like not put in all that work and just to like to have it like they just said yeah. So you just do all you just do all of it in a second. You're done with the game. Like you're already like maxed or whatever. I, I seriously don't understand how that's fun. Um, another thing about hackers. Um, so yeah, I think that's um uh, that's pretty good on it. Yeah, the pretty much so far. But yeah, Roblox really needs to improve its reports. Review those reports. Find more hackers. Please take out the hackers and please just find a way to stop these hackers from finding more commands. Seriously, I feel like. That's like a bug that they should fix or something. Maybe they should find the sites. Um, no, I don't get me wrong. I like Roblox. I plenty of you like Roblox. I like Roblox. I like the games on it, but um, the hacker issue is a big deal, and I'm sure it should be stopped. So um, I'm pretty sure that you guys would agree with me. Um, because I'm um, yeah, it's probably happened to you guys before. But anyways. Thank you for watching today's video, and I will see you on the next one if I make a next one, and I probably will make a next one. Yeah, that that was yeah, my bad, guys. Right, I'll see y'all later.